Hey gang, we're here with Scooter. We're gonna talk about the life of a spotter right here on Pet Bash. And Scooter, what's being a spotter all about? It's about being that outside set of eyes for the race. You've got uh, Winnie on race control, you know, for the safety aspect, for, for the red flags, for any cars up ahead. And then there's the hole, you know, the gaps opening up, telling the guy how many lengths he's clear behind. And, you know, off the start, it's very clear, you know, you've got one either side of you. You need to try and make the most of the gaps that are opening up for you. And obviously he's got a limited field of vision. He can only see what you can see through the windshield. So if somebody's halfway alongside him, he can't tell if you wanted to move over left or right. So it's a mixture of performance, strategy, and primarily safety. For those uh, kids watching in the audience, uh, or for that matter, anyone, uh, tell us what you got to do to train to be a spotter. I and mean, where does that expertise really come from? Well, I'm, a, I'm the crew chief. So I think it's, a, it's having a good understanding of the of the race, the strategy that you, you've got, um, the way the joker's planning out, whether the joker's going to be quicker or slower. I think more than training, it's experience. It's guys that have been in the racing business for, for a long time. Uh, it's about confidence as well. The driver needs to be really confident. And his spotter, they need to be sort of, you know, almost quite good friends. You know, things are said over the radio, which sometimes are regretted later. It's a, it's a, it's a difficult relationship. It's a bit like being married.